Yes. Damien! Damien! Does your head hurt? It does when you fucking talk. Damien, be nice to your brother. I have a headache. I have bandages. Tell him to stop annoying me. Uh, attention family, I uh, have an announcement for you. Are oh, you gay, Dad? No, don't be a smart ass, Dame, otherwise I won't tell you. Shut up, Damien! What is it, Dad? Well, you know how I said I was going out to get chemicals for the pool? Well, I did that, but I also picked up something else as well. Special delivery, cats! No way. Oh, Shell, you got out early. Hey, yeah, got out early because of good behaviour. Like a fucking angel I was. Got Mick over here to pick me up on you, Mick. Wanted to surprise the rest of you. Were you surprised I didn't get just the pool stuff? Yeah. Bullshit. You got out for good behaviour. Yeah. Fuck off, who'd you bribe? Oh, I didn't bribe anyone because I'm not Jack fucking Gimli. In fact, if I could bribe anyone, I'd bribe them to stay in there. It was bloody good TV reception, ping pong, time to read. Any of you ever read Aragon? I like that. I like dragons. Oh, I didn't know you liked to read, Shell. Oh, it's just I've never had time, do you? It's always go here, pick this up, how much you want, Trent. No, I don't know who that is, Officer Perry Pan. No, don't get back into that, Shell. There's other ways to make good money. Started Jim's mowing franchise. Notice that Clark Rubb is hiring. So what have you been up to, Jack? Oh, not much. Um, Simon got a Nintendo Switch for his birthday, so I've been going over there and playing with that heaps. Yeah, Nintendo Switch, eh? What the fuck's that? Some kind of G.I. Joe? Oh, honey, Shelly, you're such a tide. Yeah, still smarter than you, Dane. By your age, even I'd been further with a girl and I'm straight as a fucking arrow. Uh, how would you know? Oh, if you're not a virgin, then I am. Be nice to Damien Shell. He's still recovering from that little stunt he's two pulled off. Oh, fuck me, dead. I forgot to ask you, Dame. How many stitches you get, mate? 25. Ah, oh, 25. That's piss easy, Dame. Once this feral dog ripped me fucking spleen out, I was trying to hold it in. Trying to get myself to hospital. Oh, oh where am I? Anyway, I managed to stumble in there bloody six hours later, half dead. I reckon I've got a guardian angel looking after me. I reckon it's Nan. Do you, don't you reckon my guardian angel's Nan? Yeah, she loved you, Shell. Yeah, it was no wonder she did, though. I was the best kid out of all of you. I could jump the highs, smash you in marbles, beat the fuck out of you in wristies. Yuck! Shell, don't say that stuff in front of the kids. Oh, excuse me, love. Time in the slam has made me somewhat aloof to the peculiarities of the outside world. Well, anyway, Shell, we thought we'd get you something. Oh, did you know? Oh, yous are a bunch of sly bastards, aren't you? It's a uh, $30 voucher for Bunnings. No. Yeah, just a little something to get you back on your feet. Oh, fuck. <laughs> These guns are gonna make me cry. I noticed that um, lawnmower oil's on special for $27.50. Yep. That's not bad. That should uh, help you get on your way to your Jim's mowing franchise. Yeah, maybe. And you'd have enough left over for a snack. Oh no, I'm not doing that, love. Ever since they made that stupid bloody rule about the onions, I'm not buying them on principle. Well, give me one, I'll eat it. Bunny snags are fucking mad. No, I'm not doing that, Dane. Tell you what, though, I'll give your girlfriend one, because she must be fucking aching for a sausage. Oh, piss off, Arnie Shelley. The joke's fucking old. <laughs> Yeah, nah, scaring you up never gets old, Dame. But that's gonna be nice lying down in your own bed. That's the thing I missed the most when we went to the big banana. The motel was nice and everything, it's just, it's just not home, is it? Oh yeah, speaking of, Dale, um, me landlord's changed me locks on me. Doesn't trust me anymore, he thinks I'm some kind of fucking criminal. Yeah, I wonder why he thinks that. <laughs> yeah, nah, fair cop, Dame. Anyway, just while I'm sorting myself out, I was wondering if you should mind if I could crash on your couch, you know, just for a couple of days or whatever. No, Shell, don't be ridiculous. You can have Dane's room. What the fuck? Put Jack on the couch and Auntie Shelly in Jack's bunk. No, that bunk's too small for Shelly. She's going to take your bed and you're going to bunk with Jack for a couple of days. It's not going to kill you. It'll kill me. Oh, don't you worry, Dame. I'm gonna give you 30 seconds to clean out all the incriminating shit in your room. You know, your fucking pornos, your bloody dildos. Why would I have a fucking dildo? Don't you put yours in there. Damien, come on, just move your stuff into Jack's room. Oh, I hate Damien! <sighs> fuck you, Dame. Fuck you. What do I do? Fuck 
You! Oh, I'm from Australia! And especially fuck you, Artie Shelley! Not to take it down! 29! Oh, what the? No, stop the fucking 30! 24! Start it at 30! <laughs> nah, he's a good kid, eh? Oh, you want a drag, dude? Yeah, okay, but we'll go outside, Shell. Yeah, fair, you don't want this place smelling like mine, which, speaking of, suck shit to the landlord, eh? Fuck you, Gary! So, uh, the pool should be ready in about three hours if you want to go for a swim, Jack. Um, no thanks, Dad. The pool sucks. Oh. You don't like the pool? Nah. Oh. Um, I'm gonna go over to Simon's now. Yeah? You want me to give you a lift, mate? Um, no thanks. Okay, see you, Dad. Yeah, alright. Too rude. <sighs> what the fuck did I do to get here? Please share and comment below. Command.